Hey, that's good names and welcome back to the daily advice. So this will be the last daily advice for now that is doing in one episode. So I'll be going on to showing off structural integrity and because of such the build up, pun intended, I'm going to be putting that in a couple days videos because I'm going trying to merge daily advice with a building series type thing. So today's daily advice is about air hockey slash infinite soccer. So what I have here is the simple boulder. Really? Like? Okay. So what this boulder is simply, practically just a boulder, what are you doing game? It also has a boulder underneath it, which is swinging whenever you hit it, and this game is buggy as well. You can fill in the blank with whatever you choose, because this is the internet. Yay. And this is the game. So, what the ball underneath it does is it retains the momentum of the ball so you can practically go on forever unless the game is like this should we just time it let's just time it nope nope how about some editing with this yes thank you game so what this ball will do is it will retain all of its momentum i have no clue how to fix this maybe that's why in this last update they added in Let's look at the bugs. Yeah, and I've actually had quite a few bug reports. So I'm going to pull you along so I don't have to run into that stupid piece of timber over there. People these days. So, as you can see, I just pulled it a little bit. I'll go into F8 mode. Yeah, you didn't break it. Uh, so you can see the strand there of rope. If we go down. Ooh, a pendulum. So that'll contain the inertia of the ball, and if it weren't to have this little inertia keeper, it would have stopped probably over there. Probably. Haven't tried it in comparison. But this is what I mean for infinite soccer. If you were to hit it, we it will keep going at about the same rate of fire. <laughs> same rate for by the way, that's why I made this giant platform. To go! Run! Run with me! Yay! So there it goes, carrying on over there. I have no clue if these things are actually frictionless. That'd be funny. So also there's walls underneath here so that it doesn't go pinging off when I hit it. But this is a way that you could either increase your soccer games because there's a lot of friction in this, in this game against voxels. Just be because it is that game and you just had to do that, obviously. No, that's a rule of life for these giant boulders. You have to be troublesome. So, in comparison, that one goes rolling off. Hm. I didn't actually stand still. I kind of ran with it. Maybe? Maybe. But this is a way to make it a little bit more confusing of a soccer game, or I guess, in a way, air hockey. And just have a nice, fun, different, and interesting soccer game whenever they add in multiplayer. So once again, thanks for watching this daily advice. As usual, there will be another one out tomorrow. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did indeed like this advice. If you do have any suggestions on advice or something you would like me to look into, please do add that in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one.